Hello everybody, welcome back for some more Sonic Unleashed. And I just got done doing horrid stuff in terms of levels, of course. And now we're doing uh, Arid Audit Sands Night Act 1. And after that we're going to go back to Skyscraper Scamper and then do the day version of that one. Um, I was just, you know, uploading the video for like episode 8. Because that's pretty much what it's going to be. It's going to be episode 8. That's the extra one. You guys can skip that one if you need to. And what have you. So, yeah, continuing on, we're just going to do um, a night stage and then a day stage, of course, because that's just how these things work. Also, uh, fire mages have spawned, so now we're going to start using water barrels to throw at them, and that's pretty much going to be like the main gimmick for this entire level right here. And it is not going to be fun. This is not going to be a really fun level to do. Also, does I have level... I have level... 5 or 6 for... Yeah, we're level 6 for both sun and moon. Okay. Well, that's good. That's better. Okay, so anyway, the fire guys, they're annoying because of the fact that, like, if you try to hit them, they will just burn you. It's unfortunate, but that's why this is the thing, and why water is just a thing that's going to be relatively constantly around. So, all right, he's dead. I'm actually kind of pleased to finally be able to play a goddamn, you know... Just regular run-of-the-mill night mission here. Because I've been having such a terrible time trying to actually get to one. I don't even care what my ranking is. I just need these medals because we need to get day no uh we need to get a lot more day medals to continue on. Which of course means that we're gonna have to play a lot more night missions. Because the only real missions that do technically give you a good amount of medals for day side of things is gonna be none other than you guessed it, night missions. So hopefully you guys enjoy a lot of the hacking and slashing. I, I don't personally mind it that much. I do genuinely enjoy, enjoy the Werehog stages. I know there's people out there that don't, and I haven't really seen anybody commenting about it or not, so I don't know if you find folks out there watching this, of course, enjoy it or not. I would just assume that if somebody didn't enjoy it, they would probably just skip the video entirely and just watch something else, which is perfectly fine. You know, there's no harm in that. I'm just saying, like, I could at least get some details that way and be like, oh, okay, so, you know, people don't, you know, they definitely don't like it. But I don't know. I feel like some people might not care. They might just want to see me doing whatever, you know? Who knows? Oh yeah, you can kill the little electric guys. If you wanted to. What the... Oh, okay. That's something I didn't think I really ever knew about. Like, I guess you can attack from behind and just go for a, a back kill. If the enemy is just, like, not aware. So why is this level so bad? Uh, because of the mages. They just ruin pretty much everything. You practically kind of have to just rely on the ability to essentially... Hope to God you can land one of these barrel shots and put them out of their fire. And eventually we're going to have to fight guys, mages specifically, that are going to respawn enemies. And that's not going to be fun. Alright, cool. Okay, nice. God damn it, stay still. All right, cool. But yeah, I'm one of the weird ones that actually enjoys the Werehog stage just a little bit. Well, once you play them like a lot, you eventually just start to kind of just grasp a lot of the mechanics, and then just everything just kind of feels feels right. You know, everything just feels right with the world. All right, let's see. Looking for medals here, because that's what we gotta do. Now, you don't have to break everything. You can you can kind of just run into things, and then eventually something will pop up. I don't think there's anything else in here that I can grab. I know of. I do see a fire guy. I'm hoping I don't get hit before I make it. So, good. Because that'd be unfortunate. There might have been another one that spawns. I don't know. Even if there is another guy, you can still punch him and stuff. It's just you're going to catch on fire. If you happen to catch on fire, you could just always go inside the water and just cool off that way. 
should be it for them. Yep. I'm still not a big fan of the Devil May Cry, you know, arena locks that these games do to you. Like, so often. You thought I was going to say God of War, didn't you? No, I'm talking specifically Devil May Cry, because that's like, you know, the son of a bitch that basically started it. There's our first son. Let's see here. Anybody I can throw? Because I just basically killed everybody. That works, actually. Because then I can do this. Still gonna be on fire, but, you know. That's fine. It's not a big deal. Let's move this out of the way, because I think we might need to use this to get up to other spots. We could theoretically use those barrels we jumped on before, maybe. If they're still there. I'll, I'll just I'll just leave it out for now, and if, if they happen to stay, then they stay, and everything's fine. Surprised there's nothing up here, though. Oh, that's right. I think we need to move the block over here. Because we need to set things down. Son of a bitch. Unless... Ah, that's right. I think we use this one instead. Yeah. Boop. There we go. Nice. So that opens up the butt. Oh, no. That opens up the door. That's what it was. I thought it was like a, like the button thing we grab onto. Come on. Get up there. Get up there, you fuck. Anything in the chest? Oh, just a big unleash energy. A lot of rings. I'll have to grab as much as I can, right? Well, we got the chance. I'm not gonna grab everything, but just grab what it, what you what you feel like you need. All right, and then um, should be able to land this. Oh fuck me! If you come up here, uh, there's gonna be obviously a metal back here, and then should be more stuff that you can grab onto up here. Should be. I don't exactly remember fully, but... Okay. There's the wind, guys. I guess. That's the thing. Water barrels. Blue metal. I'm gonna have to probably jump down there to hit him, but... Yeah. Alright, let's do it. What other choice we have, right? Oh. I don't know if the wind guys can help or not with fire guys. I haven't really tried that out, to be honest with you. So this area kind of also sucks too, because you have four different puzzle doors you have to unlock. Also bugs. And bugs are just never fun to deal with, just in general, when it comes to these games. Oh, that's it. That's it for that area, but wait until we have to... Oh. Yeah, the electric guy. Uh, yeah, metal right here. And then, um, the tricky thing is, well, there's a metal right here, but the way they trick you is, you, you, you kind of hardly see it, but right here is where the blue water colored, you know, puzzle lever thing is at, so make sure you don't, you know, miss out on that one. Okay. And then we're going to have to do another fight, and then we're going to go upstairs and fight again. Oh yeah, just tons of fights. <laughs> so keep your unleashed, at least for that, I would suggest. Poof. Let's fuck these guys. Oh, I'm about to die, shit. Yeah, if I don't care if I'm about to die. <laughs> Dick ass. It's always the fire bastards that just ruin everything. But yeah, here's red. I don't see anything more I can grab. Yeah, these we can do. Nothing here. Oh my god, dude. I don't give a fuck. Shit, he's gonna get his life back too from that, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Yeah, they basically, whenever you fuck up a Quinto, I bet they can typically sometimes just kind of like full heal, and it's just kind of dumb. There, is he dead yet? 
I died. To bullshit. Because everything has to be fire related. Alright, well we got the checkpoint and we're fine. Should be fine. Yeah, it's kind of dumb that you have to rely on this crap, but it is what it is. These fucking bugs just do not. Uh, yeah, and that's another thing that pisses me off about this game, too, is like sometimes you just. Dude, come on. Dude, come on. There, he's dead. Yep, see, I gotta fucking grab him. Water again. I'm surprised it actually worked that time, because sometimes it just doesn't fucking work. <laughs> Alright, well that's over with. For the millionth fucking time. I'm just gonna leave the the thing there. If anything, I'll take this jackass with me. That way, I can let him cause some mayhem. If we're lucky. Okay, maybe not. Maybe it just has to be in water for that to work. Eh, probably, I don't know. Shit! What? Was I just not fast enough? Because I'm pretty sure I thought I pressed A, but... I don't know. Can you grab things, please, game? Okay. You know, at this point, I might as well just use my Unleash just to fucking get rid of these wasps. Because they're gonna... Yeah, they're gonna fucking kill me. If I'm not careful enough. <laughs> God damn. And the problem is, like, there's no way to get water around here because, you know, it's all fucked anyway. Dude. Dude! Just grab the fucking barrel. That's it. I had it. I don't give a fuck anymore. I'm just sick of this shit. Sick of these fucking bugs, dude. I'm seriously sick of them. They're not fucking fun to fight. One bit. Because all they do is just run around and fly away and just stay the fuck away the entire time. And then more spawn. Because of course they do. See, even when I... I try to go to hit them, right? And they just move. They just move every fucking time without fail. And sometimes Sonic just doesn't even fucking hit them. Because I guess he just doesn't. <laughs> you see what I mean? Like, maybe you have to wait for them to get done attacking, maybe, but look at this shit. Yeah, you think that's fair? I, 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 I don't think that's fucking fair at all. That is so incredibly just fucking stupid. Like, Sonic literally will not attack the characters. His moves will just go through them. He's gonna throw. Yeah, now I have much of a choice. Do we have any barrels left? Probably not. Which practically means that I'm fucking st Oh, we did have one, but I fucked up. Better yet, only way to really probably get through this. <laughs> oh, that's a nightmare and a half to deal with. Let's just go back and grab some stuff. I know it's kind of pointless, but... Might as well grab some extra stuff while we're over here. And here's, of course, the green one. The red one's back there. But I'm just gonna... I'm not gonna bother with them too much right now, because I don't want to get them mixed up and lost, and, and the potential of dying could come. So. Okay. Let's get rid of that floor. So now I'm gonna go up here. I don't remember if this was optional or not, but... I'm just gonna say probably not. So get ready for a very long fight. And I mean... Really long fight. Like, just... Incredibly stupidly long. Uh, if anything, I'd recommend just going straight for the mage, guys. Just save yourself the trouble now. 
and just fight them. And try your best to keep your unleashed, you know, going. Yeah, you call this fucking fair? I, I sure as fuck don't. The problem with keeping the unleashed form going is that uh, enemies tend to be dicks. I'm just hoping we don't fuck this up. If I fuck this up, I'm pretty much just fucked. <laughs> I have to be careful. Yeah, I gotta be really fucking careful. I'm playing it very dangerously here, and that's not a good idea. Anything I can grab onto. Anything that give me life at all. I probably should just kill these guys. Dude, just... God, just die. And then, yeah, I forgot he's going to respawn them. Or at least heal him. This doesn't work all well. I wonder if I could just upgrade my life right now. <laughs> to just do it that way. I don't know if that's going to work. Barely. But yeah, staying in unleashed form will definitely serve a good purpose here. Especially toward the wasp dudes, because... You know, they're just going to get in the way. Okay, nice. Actually, if anything, we probably should upgrade strength while we got the chance. That way we can just make things a lot faster. Because this one will actually have a, a real effect. So it doesn't seem like life's going to really matter much. Because I assume if you're already basically, you know, dying, then the game doesn't seem to fucking care. Okay, let's play it safe. Because that's why. <laughs> that's literally why. Come on. Yeah, that, that bug could have killed me there. Okay, he's dead. Hopefully that's the last of the wasps. And I think all we have left right now is probably maybe just the mage guys. Okay, nice. Okay, even nicer. Yeah, see, this is what's kind of lame. That you, guys have, you have to wait for them to respawn in. It takes a bit. It's Sonic Unleashed. What more do you want? Either he's the last one, or there's at least one more. Okay, thank fuck Christ. We made out there alive. Now I just gotta get to the lever without dying. I keep saying lever, but... You know what I mean. Gotta get to these things without basically dying. So yeah, one, two, and three are back here. And then, of course, the blue one's in the water, so... I think it's just the fan dudes that are spawning. I don't think I need to worry too much. Yeah, you want to talk about awful levels. Well, there you go. That's that's what we get. I should get a checkpoint soon. It should be all right. Best part is we have unleash uh, meter. So worst comes to worst, we'll just use that. We get the chance. But yeah, definitely not one of my favorite levels, uh, mainly because of the fact that everything is a goddamn nightmare. I don't know why you didn't just automatically put in, but okay. Okay, cool. That's it. About a 20 or so minute stage. And it's just going to get a little bit worse from here. <laughs> Well, actually, no, that's like the worst of it. For this level particularly, that's like the worst of it. And yeah, I know there's like mines all around and what have you, but they're not that big of a deal. They really just aren't too troublesome. These ones are probably going to explode. Surprised they didn't. Yeah, we're pretty much like 
right at the tail end here. So, I'd say go for whatever mage spawns, you know, without fire first. It's like, fire mages usually are just gonna have just fire on them. And you don't have to worry about them too much. It's just like the respawning mages, which I don't know which ones are the ones that respawn, but... Oh my god, you were so fucking stupidly lame, dude. Alright, that's it. They want to play like trash, we'll play like fucking trash. Oh, I see you. We're getting a lot of experience though from this. Holy shit. Okay, these buggers are gonna spawn. Is that. No? Okay, I guess that's it. I guess. <laughs> Alright, cool. Um, let me see here. Yep, metal back here. Because, of course. We need to jump up here. Well. Probably want to deal with these guys first. I, I probably should do that instead. There we go. Nice. Pretty sure we got everything in here that we needed. Yeah. Practically. And then everything should be fine over here. It's just a dude with water things you can throw. I forgot that I died. That's why I don't have a lot of rings right now. Um, we're going to need this block... But what I want to do first is this. Oh yeah, I forgot they break. Fuck! I think that's it for that one. Yep. Son of a bitch. I did that so well the first time I originally did it. It's fine. Wait. Go back this way. Kind of lame you can't actually just push it in multiple directions like, you know, other games will allow you to do. But that's what it is. Yeah, they don't fucking respawn at all. That's fine. Am I hearing things or did it? Yeah, I'm definitely hearing things. It's definitely coming from the block I'm pushing. Like, these things should respawn, right? Because, like, I, I wouldn't think they would keep you away from being able to access the end scenario. I don't know. I'm just going to go straight for this guy first because I know they're going to be a pain in the ass. Granted, yes, the big guy is going to do a stomp, and he could potentially hit the other guys, if we're lucky. Uh-oh. Doesn't look like we're really that lucky. Yep, see, he hits you once, hits you again. If you're unlucky, uh, he could stomp it. Oh, my God. Yeah, shit like that should just not exist. Shit that just knocks you that far away should just not be a thing. <laughs> Book. I don't think there's any more fire dudes, is there? I don't think so. Oh, we got full unleashed, so. Fuck him. There we go. Yeah, see, if you get too close and he stomps, you're just gonna do that. It's a pain in the ass, but that's just... Oh my lord, dude. Well, I can't see anything because the camera won't let me. <laughs> He's gonna do his thing. I'm just gonna let him stomp. Fucking A. Alright, nice. Big guy's down. We can leave, but... I'm greedy. I want these guys dead, at the very least. They deserve to die. For the trouble they put me fucking through. Again, I don't know why the game does that. Like, it matters, I guess. He still died anyway, so it's fine. There's more? Ugh, I'm not bothering with him. Is this one of those... How do you open this, then? There's, like, it looks like there's things like... Uh, who gives a shit anymore? It's already like 25 minutes in this fucking map. It took me 22 minutes, I still got an S rank. Holy shit. Alright, cool. Uh, you know what? I'm going to upgrade life again. Just because. I feel like at this point it's probably more necessary right now to get that one going as hard as I can. Combat? Not really, because... 
you know, it's just extra moves, and we already have, like, a lot of moves to kind of just rely on anyway. That get us what we need, so it's not a big deal. Alright, um, now we're going back to Empire. And I don't know where the store was located, so I'm just not going to bother waiting for it. Even though I had a hard time doing that one, I still love this game, but I think it's more so that since I'm recording at the same time, it's making it a lot harder to just sort of be able to retain my frustration because like it's just more like I just want to get it over with. I just want to go, I just want to go, I just want to go. You know, I want to beat this level, I want to beat this level. I guess that's a new one. Have we ever even done this side of the things via the night? I don't think we have. One of these episodes, I'll show you guys... Um, the missions thing. Yeah, okay, cool. A couple more new, uh... What the fuck? Dude looks like that guy from Cyber Sleuth. Let's take that. Neato. Oh. We're out of souvenirs, but... Could always just buy the new, uh... Stuff. Nuclear talk wool. Okay, I'm not gonna buy everything. I'm just buying this stuff for just my own account, just in the off chance I happen to want to. 100%, 100%. Well, I got the chance, actually. I probably should just eat. Like 30, 20, 5. Probably another 5, right? Oh, 10. There we go. Sorry I match so much, it's just what I do. <laughs> I hate waiting. I hate it! Okay, so we gotta do this side via day stage now. Which means we gotta go up to like the top left-ish or whatever and then figure out how to get through there. Because we've already done the night version of it. Now we just gotta do the day version of it. So cool. Ah, sorry, my nose is getting itchy. I know it doesn't sound like it, but... Oh, yeah, here we go. Okay. So this is, um... Yeah, Skyscraper Scamper Act 1. Let's do it. Okay. I don't remember if there's a boss fight or not. I don't... No. Not yet, anyway. Next episode, maybe. Whee! Alright, so now we're basically doing the thing that I'm pretty sure everybody's been waiting for to see. More boost running. Actual levels. I wanted to land on that. <laughs> Here's the problem! Yeah, see, I go too fucking fast, and then I just try to drift, and I still fuck it all up. Oh, let's try that again, I guess. Yeah, if you're wondering, there's it basically just leads you around to this for that little uh that rail right there just needs you right to be to this so nothing special fuck <laughs> that was scary my buttons are so damn bad anyway well not my controller buttons but just me pressing buttons mm, Sonic you fucking the drifting is just so fucking hard, man. It's so fucking hard to do it. Especially when you're going, like, so goddamn fast. Yeah, I have to I have to stop at corners. I have to stop being so fucking fancy, I guess. That's fine. <laughs> this is why this game is definitely not a, what I would consider a boost-to-win game type game. No doubt about it. It's a lot harder to win if you're going to be boosting. Let's look for medals. I mean, reasonably, you never really know. Oh, there's bound to be probably one up there in there. Oh! Fuck it, whatever. Nice save. Pretty cool section right there. Okay, VHS. I just realized, we're, I mean, we're, we're still, like, over halfway done with the game. Like, we're still pretty good progress. It's just that I'm remembering some of the levels that we haven't gotten to do yet. That I re re remember specifically doing. And specifically hating, so... 
Is there a way up there? Yes, there is. Cool. I could use that. Right, let's line up and then just blast him. Fuck him. Whoa, hey! <laughs> Going a little fast there, huh, game? Whoa! Yeah, wait till we get to colors and then you'll see, like, me probably just being even worse, actually. No, I'm not that bad at colors. For fuck's sake, like... It's in such a terrible position. That's hard to land that. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh. Again, I think we lead practically the same place. It just kind of slows you down a bit. A lot of these later levels are just going to probably do that. Cool. Sorry. All right. We out. Fuck. It's all right. The cool part about this, though, at least for the 360 and PS3 versions of this game, is like you don't really have to fight this boss necessarily. In the PS2 and Wii version, you pretty much have to fight him. No reason, just wasting boost for no reason. Like, you have to do, like, an actual sort of battle type thing with him. You have to jump and attack, I think it was. I don't remember specifically exactly every detail, but... I remember it being kind of like a sort of sweat of fight thing, anyway. What? Oh, let's get a bit... Must have got hit by electricity or something. Whoop! I keep hitting the stick to turn, or to jump on a new one. Oh, that was scary. <laughs> I think there was something down that way. I mean, I'm pretty sure, yeah, there's like another path you could take, but I already fucked up, so it's too late. God damn. Imagine being able to do this, like, like while in boost. Like, that shit's impressive. Because I suck. Clearly. Well, think about it this way. Let's not play Shadow the Hedgehog, so... Pfft. You want to see me really suck at a game? <laughs> As a joke, I kind of thought, like, you know, at one point, like, well, what if I just, you know, say, like, hey, you know, guys, if I don't finish... Oh, my lord. Why does that not home attack on the guy that was of him? Why did you not catch him? Oh! So, yeah, like, as a joke, like, what if I did, like, Shot the Hedgehog? Like, if I didn't, uh, fulfill my promise of beating the Sonic Generation Project, like, what if I just do that instead? That'd be kind of funny if I did that. Just do Shot the Hedgehog. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna try to boost too hard here. Uh, just because. Shit's dangerous. Probably shouldn't do it too much here, either. I should just be a little bit more careful with how I'm boosting here. If I had the confidence to make it through one side of things, then it's fine. Actually, who the fuck did we die on last time? Oh, I know how we died last time. It wasn't even because of boost, it was because of the goddamn uh, homing attack that kind of fucked me. Oh yeah, I can do that. Let's just avoid these guys. Damn, Sonic, you're kind of slippery, aren't you? Oh, that was actually a nice grab, shit. Okay, is the game going to work with me this time, or are you just going to boost me through and kill me? There, done. Alright, cool. That's the end of the level. Or, end of the video, basically. Mm -hmm. Not pretty fucking speed, can me? <laughs> Not right now. No, that's already too goddamn fast. Okay, so that takes basically care of that. I'm just trying to figure out where... We probably have to go back to Sp um, Spagonia to figure out what he's got to say. Wait, what's new at Hearts has, though? Oh, we haven't even gone here yet. I'm trying to think. Do we do the day one? Or are we doing night? Oh, yeah, I think we do night first. 
Well. Okay. Well, that'll be for next time, then. Um, make sure I know what I'm doing here. Yeah, we did we did Arya Sands night and we did Sketch Grapers game for a day. Okay. I just gotta keep up with uh what has all been done. But this one should be the next place we go to. I believe so. Look for any medals while we're here. You never know. There are probably a few out there somewhere. I mean I mean I think there is. <laughs> no matter what. Just don't remember exactly oh, there's one. Can't get under there, I guess. For some bizarre reason. Oh. There's two right here. Like, just flat out. Oh, yeah, I gotta go... I gotta go from the top to get that. You have to go, like, down here. There you go. Alright. Yeah, we're just there, too. What the hell? So, anyway, uh, I think that'll probably be good for this episode. So, next time, we're just gonna do, like, another night mission and then another day mission. At least, that's what... It should be like, as long as we can actually do these first. I don't know. I pretty much finished when I needed to. I think the reason why Arid Sands is telling me to go back there is probably because of the fact that uh, the professor needs to be talked to. So if anything, I could just go ahead and head that way. If I somehow can't figure out if we can get to the next level or not. Um, which I think we have the day time first. I think we have the daytime first platform and then nighttime platform. Ah, fucking might as well do it now. <laughs> yeah, why not? Oh, there's a thing right there. But what the hell? Whatever, I, I don't know. Sometimes this game likes to be a little strange. With the way that it does things to me. Give it a few seconds here, folks. Alrighty then. If it's not open for some reason, then that's just bizarre. Okay, it is open. Okay. And that's what I think it is, right? Like, this is Act 1 of the next stage? Jungle Joyride Act 1. Sure is. Alright. So, yep. See you all next time, and take care, everybody. <laughs>